Hey everyone, welcome back. In this video, we are going to check the image that we have entered exist or not using file exist function. So before getting started, if you are new to this channel, do subscribe and hit on the bell icon. So whenever I upload one new video, you will get a notification on it. Do follow me on my Instagram page as well. Let's get started. So in previous video, we have seen how to store image into a database and these were the image that we have stored if you have not yet watched this video do watch it so that you will get an idea of what is happening in this video i will give you guys the link in the description go check it out and uh, yeah so in this video we will check if the entered file for example if this user 2.jpg if it is already in our database when we are again trying to enter the same file it has to give us file already exist message so let's see how to do that here when we click on this save image button it was going to code.php with the post method and performing the action so here we have to check if that file is already existing then we have to display one message telling that file is already existing for that we have to write one if condition before this insert query let's do that so if if that file already exists then it has to display a message telling file already exists else if that file is not uploaded or not stored then we have to insert so here in else part we'll have this insert query so let's cut this and paste it inside else. Done. So here inside if condition we will be using file exist to check. So here we have one function called file exist. So inside this function we have to give two things. One is the folder name that we have and the other thing is the image name. So here the folder is in the root directory itself. So here we have to give the folder name which is uploads. So uploads give a slash and here concatenate it with the file name which is file image name. Copy this and paste it here. This is not a comma dot is used to concatenate. So now this is set. So if that file exists we have to display a message using session. So here give dollar session of status is equal to tell image already exists and give a semicolon then redirect back to header location which is location and direct back to index.php so that's it let's go and reload the output and check if this is working properly this was our output here let us give some name i'm gonna click and use the same image which is already in our database stored in our database so open and here I have to get a message which is file already exists. So save image you can see hey image already exists. Here we will mention this file name as well. So what we will do is go back to your code here create a variable. We will give this variable as file name and this is the file name. So paste this here, give a semicolon and concatenate with this. Use a dot and copy this, paste it here. Use dot here. Or else you can do one more thing. Instead of pasting this here at the end, let us cut this, paste it here and here let us concatenate. Okay. So here we are telling that that file name it will come user2.jpg image already exists. 
let's go and check our output let us reload first and enter again which is sneha give the phone number sneha at gmail.com and i want to choose the same image which is user2.jpg open this and when i click on save image i have to get the message so let me click on save image you can see here user2jpg image already exists let us give the space between this so go here now let us go and test once again enter the phone number enter email and i want to choose the same image and click on open here you can see hey user2.jpg already exist so this is how you check how the file is already existing in php so i hope this video was helpful and if you have any doubt or suggestion let me know in the comment section and if you are new to this channel do subscribe thank you for watching